Is it recording? Assalamu alaikum and greetings, Ali Sharma here and welcome to my freezing main cave and more RC video reviews. Today in this video I have this. Today in this video I have the Eshin Emax Interceptor FPV buggy or FPV racing buggy. Yes, you can race this with your friends and family members if you have two or three. This comes as a complete bundle FPV buggy that you can drive right outside the box and you can FPV right outside the box. And I can tell you this is a whole lot of different FPV experience and fun. Even if the weather is bad, just like nowadays it's raining, dark and dirty outside. I have lots of RC cars sitting here that I want to review, but mm -mm, I cannot do anything. I have new RC planes, I cannot do anything. So this is gonna bring me fun while I drive it indoors and have fun driving FPV indoors. I can set an obstacle course and have fun with it. So let's unbox it and start FPV driving right away. So this is your Ishin Emax Interceptor FPV racing buggy. It comes with FPV video goggles. By the way, the video goggles have two antennas which tell you, ooh, this is diversity, baby. Uh, well, it came with only one antenna. I have no idea why. So that makes me doubt that it is not diversity. Anyway, for my own, you know, uh, piece of heart I added one more antenna just to look cool maybe it has a USB cable for you to charge the FPV car and the battery of the uh, FPV goggles and a little screwdriver and one screw it has a little radio control and your Emacs Ishin FPV racing buggy you also have the Emacs 3.7 volt 1800 mAh lipo pack inside there's a light ion battery and you can charge this battery using this USB cable port using this USB port right here and obviously this is to power your FPV video goggles nice and simple I love it man very small does the job has very good control proportional throttle proportional steering very precise proportional throttle and steering and have little shock absorbers as well spring loaded obviously and uh, an FPV camera all-in-one FPV system is installed right there in order to charge it has a built-in battery also which you can remove but in order to charge the battery you can charge it right through the car using the USB cable okay so you just plug it and car will start charging or the buggy will start charging you can also remove and replace the battery from this compartment which is a very very good idea if the battery becomes bad obviously you have to remove and replace the battery it has an on off switch right here okay and a little brushed motor backside at the back of the buggy it does a very good job driving I have driven it and I can tell you this is absolutely a different kind of fun all right FPV car is on let's see how it drives I'm driving slow just to see how it drives actually speaking if if we are speaking about the controls they are absolutely nice look how proportional the throttle is so you can drive it nice and slow and go you know around the obstacles with precise control proportional throttle and proportional steering really nice and sensitive All right, I have set up my SkyZone OLED goggles with DVR here, so they will actually record. Let's see how good the FPV video goggles from Emacs Ishin are. It says Emacs, and right there you have the picture. Check this out. It's nice, man. Really nice and big screen inside. On my face, nice and comfortable. Here, there's a lot of opening under the nose. I can adjust this lens. Ooh, if I put the lens all the way back, it's really nice and comfortable. And I have a nice big, big screen to watch. Okay. See, this is, this is really wrong. When you want to adjust the goggles, the channel and frequency buttons are right here. And once you click, you know, your video is gone. Okay, I'm back. So I'm just 
I'm going to be very, very careful. Already this side, uh, the fog has started building, but anyway, let's drive. Oh man, this is, this is a different experience of FPV. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, don't hit the Isshin F22 Raptor. Keep going. Arrive at WL Toys. I have set simple obstacles here. There's another WL Toy car. You want to see what this is. Reception is fine, except there's a little bit of glitching, but apart from that, everything is fine. J11 float plan. I actually left it for as an as an obstacle here. Ah oh, man, driving it is really different feeling, and it's it's fun. Basically, actually, I really want to have more of these so that you know we can go racing i irish and hadi we can actually race indoors well no worries i can always prepare another rc car and set it up with fpv uh, the mini rc car and we can drive and race but the only thing will be that rc car is going to be very very fast and that will be like cheating you know not fair so I'm just going to go and jump that obstacle. I built the little jump. Oh, sorry, the car drifted right here. Ah, oh, come on. I got stuck. Yeah, the buggy has a very small motor, which is not that powerful, in fact. But hey, man, it's absolutely fun to drive this thing around, around the house, around obstacles. Let's see, how is the reception if I go into this room? Uh-oh, that door is closed. Mommy, can you open that door for me, please? Thank you. I'll go to this bedroom, and reception is very nice and clear. Our bedroom door... And if I go here, reception is still okay. I'm having glitches, but I can still see I'm making a U-turn now. I'm coming to go to another room. Yeah, I'm here going to the balcony. I still have reception in my Emacs goggles, which is very nice, man. Very nice. I can drive around the rooms. And I have clear reception. I'm not using, I'm not losing, not using, I'm not losing any video. Though there are glitches, but overall, it's amazing. I killed the F-22 Raptor. Ah, it is nice, it is nice. Very nice feeling to drive, and it is absolutely fun to drive, man. I wish we can drift it. Just like this. Nah, this is not drifting, that's just slipping. Dodge the F-22 Raptor there. Uh-oh, didn't, didn't climb that J-11 this time. Now before the battery runs out, I want to put on the SkyZone OLED goggles and enjoy. Oh man! <laughs> oh man, this is... This is clear it is absolutely a different type of picture different type of clear picture okay very nice now i can see many more things much more clear and you can see how easily i can actually dodge all these obstacles now i'm having some kind of distortion lines when i go a little farther but apart from that, everything is fine. Just those distortion lines, they are not due to the video goggles, they are due to the video system on the buggy. Going in this other room, oh nice, made a nice turn. Going behind the closet, look, I'm losing a bit of video, but overall, I can still make my turn and go drive around. Oh no, that was bad. Okay, I hit this Emacs box. 
Let's go to this room again. Go to the balcony. I still have nice video. Though glitching, but I can see what I'm doing. Man, I can tell you this is a different experience. It is so much fun to drive this car around. All right, for the conclusion of this little video I did here, Eugene Emax Interceptor FPV buggy little RC car is absolutely fun. I'm really having fun driving FPV around. It's a total different experience. Now, I know many people would love to do FPV and all you need to do is strap an FPV system on an RC car and, you know, start driving FPV. But what if you don't have an FPV system? You don't have a radio control. You don't have anything. This complete bundle is really gonna save the day there because everything is included to drive FPV right outside the box and you're gonna have lots of fun. I'm not done with this yet. I'm not done with this yet. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna charge the batteries and bring this car out and enjoy some FPV outdoors. Come on, you know what to do. Hit that like button. It's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button. Right there. Come on, don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support towards my work. That I post regular and fresh content on my channel just for you. Hit that like button. Right there.